Welcome back, everyone. It is so great to see our friend, Chef William Meeks, with Infused Catering. And my goodness, Chef, you have got quite the lineup here. What, what, what are we dealing with right now? So some of these are some of our biggest um, um, uh, attractions for all of our corporate events that we have. Uh, we're trying to uh, get a little bit further into that <clears throat> and really um, put a better product for what they're used to. You know, everybody mm -hmm. gets barbecue, everybody gets sandwiches. So we're trying to hit that same price point, but get something hot and delicious and a little bit more traditional. Oh. And did I hear too, it's, it's infused catering by William or with William? Is that the new kind of Title? Yes, so Infused Catering uh, has been Infused Catering for many, many years. Uh, when I bought Infused Catering at the end of last year, uh, we went with the same product model and the same uh, food and that kind of stuff for a long time. Mm -hmm. um, it's just not the style that I'm trained to do. Mm -hmm. So we're going more for a farm to table um, uh, organic fill. Uh, everything in the entire kitchen is 90% scratch now. Uh, we're getting to the point where we start making our bread and our really fine desserts as well. Mm. Um, We've outgrown the current location that we're in. So at the end of the month, we actually get to go into the new Frisco building, into that kitchen over there, and have a cafeteria and the whole nine yards. So we're, nice. we're, we're really excited. That's awesome. Congratulations. Yes. Thank, you. Thank you. So with expanding and growing, you know, uh, what are some hurdles that you maybe have encountered that you weren't expecting or, you know, wins for your company? You know, we, we, Employees are the biggest thing that we need to succeed. Uh, we have been very blessed to pull some very, very uh, uh, server-friendly people that uh, know hospitality, and that's mm -hmm. what we really try to focus on. It's not about, I think anybody can offer good service, it's the hospitality. We want you to have a new experience when you leave. We want you to talk about the food. You know, if you come to a wedding, we obviously want you to be there for the wedding, but we also, okay. you know, we want that memory of, man, that salad was awesome, or uh -huh. man, that chicken was great, and that's what we try to do. Yeah. All right, Chef, let's get to the food. What, yes. do, what do you have for us today <coughs> in that you could have at your next corporate event? So our biggest salad that we have right now is the new infused garden salad. Uh, they will be seasonal and we'll have all ingredients that will be very good at that time of the year. Uh, I have some really nice organic tomatoes that are on there. Those uh, orange pieces of beauty or uh, golden beets that are local. Uh, the radishes are local. The cucumbers are local. This Everything. Is, a, is this a beet? Yes, they're beets. Are you kidding? I gotta wow. Yeah, golden beets are my all-time favorite thing in the world. Yeah, I love beets. So it gives a nice little sweet texture uh, to it that, that I think a lot of salads kind of uh, lack. It tastes like mm -hmm. a beet, but it does not look like a beet. Yeah, I know. <laughs> right? That's so crazy. I, I love it. I try to hide them a little bit because there's, there's a lot of people that don't really enjoy beets that well. So we're, you know, we're really trying to push things that people may remember from childhood that they didn't like, but they may like now. Mm -hmm. uh, our biggest, one of our really big ones is this new uh, chicken parmesan. It's very traditional. We brace the chicken. Mm -hmm. uh, we actually make um, uh, chicken uh, burgers more or less, and then we patty those so they're nice, good shape, and we can fit more in our pans. Uh, nice uh, homemade red sauce, spaghetti, and then a Parmigiano Riago uh, over the top of it, which is phenomenal. Mm. Wow. Uh, this is one of my favorite things right here, is this uh, Gouda bacon burger. Anybody can make bacon, anybody can do that. Uh, I think bacon jam is one of those lost things that oh really nobody knows Ooh. about anymore. So. Oh, wow. You kind of get the best of both worlds right here. Uh-huh. <laughs> that looks amazing. So you said Gouda bacon? Yes, Gouda bacon. Uh, so it's just Gouda cheese. Uh, they're, all of our patties, we don't buy frozen patties. Mm -hmm. All of our patties are handmade. Uh, we make everything, and then we, we, we try to ground as much stuff as we can as well and make all the burgers in the house that we can. Mm -hmm. We're trying to team up with a couple of great farmers that are giving us good deals, uh, and, they're be, and they're able to move their product, so we're trying to get them out there as well. Okay, okay. awesome. And the nachos. And the nachos so and, yes. I, who doesn't like nachos? Who doesn't like nachos? Um, this is probably our biggest seller right here. Uh, we do a lot of nacho bars. Uh, this right here is the little friendly, uh, nobody really likes jalapenos, but we call these sugar bombs where we are. We pickle them in house with a couple different pickling liquids. And people absolutely love them. They're, mm. they're oh, so, yeah. so good. So all of our tacos come with fresh pico de gallo that's made in house. Uh, our braised beef tacos right here are some of our biggest ones. And then this is a uh, chipotle chicken more or less is how I try to explain it mm. to everybody because that's what they're going to know what better is. Mm -hmm. So very simply, just a little bit of lettuce. Man, I'm getting us forks because this I, is too good not to <laughs> get nothing, out. Nothing oh, too more. crazy. Maybe a couple jalapenos on top for good measure. I love pickled jalapenos. I like anything pickled. Pickled onions, pickled jalapenos, just pickle it and I'm good. If but you, you don't really like pickles. But no, not pickles by themselves, though. That's no. weird. If you don't tell anybody, <laughs> I sneak these into the movie theater. So we can have a, oh! Oh, we, <laughs> our lips are sealed. Don't tell anybody, though. Okay? Our lips are sealed. Oh my gosh. Maybe just a little oh. queso over the top. Oh yeah. We do offer shredded cheese as well. We have sour cream, guacamole on, on request as well. So that's not a problem. 
Awesome. Oh my gosh. I don't even know where to start. I know. So what do you recommend we start with? We gotta um, try this. Come let's on. Let's try the chick parm first. Okay, okay, here we go. Chick, chick parm. parm. Chick parm. Digging in there. Oh gosh, I do love a good parm. Me oh, too. A fresh. chicken parm sandwich is one of my all-time favorite things. So we're a lot of these great things that we offer, mm. uh, we will offer in the cafe as well, which will be open at the end of October, um, and the Frisco building, and it will be open to the public. Okay, it's down mm. the Frisco building. Okay. Yeah. Our, uh, oh gosh, we're going to keep everything eight to ten bucks uh, for all the meals, and you'll be able to get a full-size mm. menu. Um, any time of the day, well, any time from about 10 a.m. to about 3 p.m. daily, wow. we will have these. That Eight is to amazing. ten bucks, you really can't, like, I can't even get a sub sandwich, like, no, for that no, much, I, or that I, little, I should say. The whole point is, uh, I'm not a fast food guy. Yep. I don't like fast food. I don't let my kids eat a lot of fast food. So we're trying to compete. Mm -hmm. And there's a lot of that kind of in that area right there. So we really want to be able to offer a great, uh, a great offering to everybody in that building and the surrounding areas. And then if we can pull some people out from the crowd as well, driving by, hopefully we can do that as well. Now, mm -hmm. you want to try a taco? Yeah, Definitely yeah. try those. Get the chicken are probably my favorite. I'm getting in there. You got chicken, yeah, I got, I got chicken. Beef. Okay. Now, is there a certain dish that you love to make? Um, it, mm. I, I love to just cook, you know. Mm -hmm. If I had to pick one thing, I love um, uh, seafood more than anything in the world. Uh -huh. So if I get to play with, you know, Chef, I'm gonna come over and... here because I gotta try that Gouda burger. Yes, mm -hmm. absolutely. With that bacon jam, because Maddie, if you, have you and had bacon jam before? I have not. And it's this, insane. This braised beef is so delicious. Thank you, thank you. Oh my gosh. I gotta get in there and get that bacon jam because that's one of my favorite things in the whole world. That's bacon jam. <laughs> All these offerings, this will be on the menu at the cafe as well. Uh, eight uh, eight mm -hmm. bucks, 10 bucks with a drink, uh, five days a week. Um, and the great news too is, nobody really knows a ton about this, but we have a food truck that's launching as well. Oh, uh, oh wow. I'm, I'm partners with a, with a really good guy in town and uh, we're, we're gonna kinda unleash that, but I gotta see wow. definitely reaction. look for that. that bacon jam. I know, I'm getting in I there. gotta see this, Sorry. this is amazing. Mm. That flavor. Of the bacon chain. Right. Mm. So okay. it's just a simple thing. One really. more time, how do people get in touch with you, book you for catering, find out about what's opening at the end of October, everything that Every, you know. Everything right here. I have I have uh, the same phone numbers as Infuse Catering. I have uh, a new email as well, but our old email will work. That's on all of our Facebook stuff and all of our uh, um, uh, social media stuff as well. So um, oh if you go to our, our page, uh, you'll be able to put an inquiry out and I will answer you within uh, a few hours, if not maybe 48 hours at the very most. Mm -hmm. This is amazing. Chef, thank you so much. So good to My see you. Goodness. Please come back. I will. We I will. Out the restaurant Absolutely. For sure, we'll have you guys out. All right, guys, All right. don't go anywhere. We'll be back talking about the Cavendish PFI tent sale. It's historic, guys. We'll be back. Okay, now I'm going to eat more. Yeah. Really fast. Get, get it.